Guess who went on a little itty bitty shopping spree? Me. Itty bitty meaning a good handful of stuff. First, I went to Uniqlo. Uniqlo! This cute little tank top. I'm still debating if I should crop it. Next, boxer briefs. These are men's medium. Set of socks, set of underwears. Next, we went to Muji, which is my favorite store because it's so cute every time i go i want to buy the whole store anyways first we got this cute little itty bitty scissor it has a case and you can like you know so i thought that'd be kind of cute we got two rolls of tape two different sizes and i think it'd be cute for like little annotations um if i become studious which probably won't happen but whatever we got two types of post-its we got this like recycled brownish thing and then two transparent Post-it notes. I've always wanted these since I saw them on TikTok, so I got them. Next, we got this itty bitty little tape measure. Look at that. It's like metal, like the, you know what I mean? Next, I got a metallic ruler because everybody needs a ruler. Then this little memo pad. It has like a bunch and the like paper is super nice. So I'm thinking I can write little letters to like, okay. The thing is, my love language is physical touch, okay? But another one is giving gifts and like writing them personal letters because I think it's just really cute. The AC just turned off. I think the electricity's out. Did I? <sighs> We're back. <laughs> it's so hot. Wait, is it off? So while the AC's coming back on, I'm gonna be drenching in sweat, but it doesn't matter. Anyway, I got a monthly notebook planner thingamabob. We'll see if I continue to use it all year, but this is the layout. Next, new bottle. My old bottle is this one. She's been through it. Can you tell? Um, if it falls, it'll make a lot of noise, so that's something to look forward to, but here's my new bottle. It's one liter. Ta-da! Lined in square paper for school. Um, we're gonna go to the Thrift Street, so I'll probably do a haul for that too. But like, aren't these so cute? Ah! Anyway, slay. Goodbye. Fingers crossed I still have money. Love you, bye. This is Tokyo, oh, baby. <laughs> Um, we got a change of hair. It's kind of cute. I did take for granted my hairstylist in Mexico. It's okay. This hairstylist got really close to the roots, so it kind of looks like I'm bald. But for now, on the camera, it looks fine. Anyways, we went to the thrift store as you saw when we were in Tokyo and I'm in back. I'm gonna do a try on haul and yes. Okay, first I got these 
shorts it's a boy's shorts okay the length is kind of at an awkward length but i think i can do something with it like maybe wear some docks hold on let me try a docks it's so like what i'm thinking is going for kind of like a 12 year old boy and i also want to do like an emma chamberlain kind of i don't know i don't know if these go together also nobody tell my grandma that i'm wearing shoes inside the house they also have the elastic inside of the shorts that you can stretch out so it fits your waist also these are from lee this is the second pair of shorts they're super cute um again the waist part doesn't fit me quite well so for that i'll use a shoelace i'll show you like a full outfit and shoes um i filmed the tiktok so i'll put it here so they're also from lee's you know what my hair doesn't look that bad anyways the last two things are jackets aren't these so cute these are so cute i love the length it's like perfect size it's not too long it's not too short it goes like with my skin tone and kind of like my hair and i love it they're a perfect fit perfect fit and the last thing i got my one of my favorite finds ever this denim jacket it's like this kind of jockey jacket this is like jean material kind of and then we got the sweater material and i love it this is one of my favorite finds i think it would be really cute for kind of like a more a more masculine outfit i've been going through this weird stage where i want to dress like feminine very like boobs out stomach out arms out legs out but at the same time i also want to do more masculine outfits whatever that means um obviously that's really difficult in japan because it's so hot i can be more versatile when it comes to my outfits when i'm back in mexico just because the weather isn't as one-sided if that makes sense those are all the clothes that i got they weren't that cheap <laughs> i bought some gifts for my friends so that's not for you to see and then so we got these just card holders because my old one is super worn out okay then I got some patches that you can put on like the back of your jeans or like on a sweater or on a tote bag. So I got five of them. Okay, we got a fire, smiley face, a Nirvana one. This one's so cute. Then I got this one, the New York somethings. Finally, we got this one. This is one of my favorite ones. Lastly, I got this hat. I've always wanted this like baseball cap type thing. It's like San Francisco. Francisco? San Francisco seal? San Francisco! San Francisco seals. On the inside it has like this little detailing and that's all I have for you. So thanks for coming on this journey with me. See you later. See you later, See you later alligator. alligator. Ew.